fellow beautiful people it's deandra if you are new here welcome and welcome back now i just did two videos for you there were two clothing hauls it was zara and nordstrom rack and right when i was checking my phone to see what's supposed to be coming there's one more supposed to be coming today but Shein surprised me okay i was not expecting to get this today at all um and they weren't giving me any uh, updates i think it's everything in one because it's a big box I'm hoping it's everything in one but we shall see so this will be a try on haul for sure um let's see how this goes <laughs> um I got a lot of different of everything all right this first one I try to be methodological when doing this because I want to keep it in the same um ziploc container if I'm going to return it so it's not like sending me the wrong money for the wrong thing all right so this is a linen set this is the shorts <laughs> i don't think this is going to fit but we shall see but these are the shorts it's a linen blend set um so that's one and then this is the top part this may fit let me come up closer i got it in two colors at the same size so if this doesn't fit the other one will not and they'll be both sent back honestly i have my eye on some other items on shein already so if there are certain things that end up not working i'm not going to be upset because at least that gives me some justification of why and what else is in the cart you know what i mean but yes let's try this on okay so i'm not even going to bother showing you the rest of it because it's showing a lot it fits I'm just gonna say that but i don't like the material it's supposed to be a linen blend but it is really rough and scratching me already and that's one of the reasons why i like linen blend over a linen because it feels softer um yeah this is going back it fits i'm looking at myself in the mirror it's not what i wanted i technically could possibly keep the top because the top is not bad it's the shorts that's not altogether my style but it is a set so it's just gonna all go back it's it's i don't even remember how much it costs i think it was probably like ten dollars it is not worth my time to keep but um if you're more on the slender side you don't have a lot of i mean granted i probably want to go up a size on this to be honest but if i said if i had to finesse it if i had to keep it I would have kept the top or worn only the top i would have never worn the shorts the shorts fit is just that it's showing a lot of my problem areas and i really hate the material on this it does not feel comfortable to be in at all so i personally i would not recommend this at all just for the material but if you are the type of person that it that does not bother you then um if you're more of a slender figure this would be for you honestly the reviews online said raved a lot on the Shein website about this they lied <laughs> it's not for me so i know for sure the i got this in a black as well it's not going to work so next we have this okay so i know what this is if you guys see my Shein um bag haul i bought this already i accidentally when returning a bag i forgot that i nested it inside of it so i sent back three bags instead of one so i bought it back okay so is this small one it has a bigger one and i also got the white version to this as well so yes these are keeping being kept because i really like them and i did want to wear them already and realize i didn't even have them so yeah if you guys don't remember this is the chain strap on it and it has the the ball that toggles back and forth right now it's protected with a blue film but um yeah that is the bag really cute simple not the best quality but it's going to give me the look that i want which is i'm fine with that now this one it may or may not work out um this is a set i did not want it to be in this material so it's like a satiny material it, it's making it seem more like pajamas than anything i'm not gonna try this on i'll just show you a picture of what this looked like i wanted it to be in a different material and since it's not that material i don't care if it's going to give me the look i don't want it at all and i don't even like the hem and how that looks yeah this is just going back <laughs> not everything in Shein is going to be winners but you can find some winners i'm not going to lie 
um, but yeah this is not my style and people were raving about this one too usually the review section of Shein is really spot on and this time it is not so <laughs> that's not good next is this okay this should be a jumpsuit if memory serves me correct yes here it goes so I have it upside down this is the jumpsuit all right it has a big sleeves here for the bust area and it's a deep V and it has a lot of space for my thighs which is helpful because I have very big thighs I think this will look very nice on let's try it all righty guys as I thought I would and I do like it um, I'm trying to cover up my bra as much as possible but I would ideally wear boob tape with this I would not wear a bra at all because it's deep v-neck or I would wear like a lacy thing inside to kind of camouflage this but I don't know if it's showing online or on the camera it does nip in the waist and has like an a-line shape I have a bad problem I like to feel the fabric in the um crotch area i'm just gonna call it that because i don't know what else to call it um but yeah i do like to feel it there when i don't put the fabric there it doesn't pronounce it as much but um yeah this is what it's looking like i think it looks i think it looks pretty good what do you guys think i think it looks cute it looks feminine it is straight out of the package so it would have some wrinkles i love the detailing here um and so forth i don't think i would pair it with a belt because i think it's just a lot going on right here already but um it would have to have a nice bag for sure i would probably style this in a different video just not now this is strictly a try on haul but tell me what you guys think it has lots of space here which is fine I don't mind that but I do like the A-line detailing it's, it's definitely brunch dinner date just a day if you want to go out in this in the daytime this would be nice too let me look at myself in the mirror I think it looks I think it looks really nice actually um, yeah I like it tell me guys what you think okay so another package came which should be the last one for today and then the rest will be coming the rest of the week <sighs> okay so after the Shein one you will get the Dianu one I hope I'm saying that name right because I've never ordered from them before and it is a black owned brand now let's get into this I bought these earrings I just couldn't resist let's see and as you know I painfully found out you cannot return any of their earrings what I do like they always give you a whole bunch of earring bags which I just keep in store because you just never know when you need them so let me take these out these are my real gold hoops from Macy's oh okay so they don't have any backs at all so that's why you have that those silicone ones let me get I think it looks cute so this is the earring it has like a pearlescent um, bottom here it's not a real pearl it's made to look like a pearl it has some texture to it I guess to make it have like some little sheen and and stuff like that as well then it has a turquoise um, part up here in a gold setting and this is how it looks on one ear it does not have a backing so that's why you need the silicone ones I think it looks quite nice actually oh my goodness sometimes I just have an eye for these things and sometimes the pictures that they show is not enough at all um, there was some people that did have this on and reviewed it and it looked nice on them and I was just like you know I think it would look nice on my skin tone and so forth curly hair and whatnot I was also thinking if because uh, when I'm on vacation usually I have on extensions I have braids so I was just like if I have box braids how would that look I think if they look nice I like them I like them they feel comfortable they don't feel so far like they are made of horrible metal so we shall see if I get any irritation from them but I'm not going to keep them on for the rest of this they will be taken off but yeah I think they they look nice all right on to the next all right next is this I bought a lot of white dresses I'm I really want to find a nice 
winter white. I think this is a decent material. It's not that shiny, horrible polyester stuff. So let me extend it so you can see it. I got it in a size large. Yes, I did. I got it in a size large. Ugh, I don't know if it's gonna look good on me. <laughs> I think I may have to send this back. It's looking quite shapeless. You do have a um, zipper at the back, which will be helpful. Um, this doesn't have much give at all. Yeah, at all. So this is pretty um, structured. I believe this is polyester. I will look, I'll give you the picture of what it looked like on the model. On some of uh, people that were reviewing this, I kind of have an idea of what it may look like on me and I don't think I would like it, but we shall see. Okay guys, I got it on and I think I like it. I took off the bra because it was just not going to look right. I was, I would not be able to cover it and all that stuff, but this is what it's looking like. I think it looks pretty nice. Tell me what you guys think. Um, I wasn't able, my arms can only go so high and I wasn't able to do that extra bit, but I honestly feel like it fits. It actually does have a little bit sorry about that it does actually have a little bit of give it's not completely that rigid um, which helps at least and also it is lined so you're not getting any see-through action here which is absolutely great I really do like this um, so this will have to be like a dinner date for sure um, I can't wear this to a wedding <laughs> so it have to be something else because it's it's like a nice um, not really pure white but it's like almost there it's like a nice really off-white um, and it looks really nice on actually I feel like a princess and honestly that's what a lot of people were saying on um, Shein it makes them felt like a it, most of them felt like a princess in this um, and it does have like an empire waist so it goes like a, a little bit down like that so it's almost like a slight v shape or a deep um u type of situation um yeah i like this i'm not wearing any shapewear if i were to wear this i may wear it without because it looks pretty good on right now um yeah i i like it I like it. Next, um, we have this. Now, this is another white dress. Yeah, I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep all the white dresses. It really depends on how they look on me, but this is a halter dress. And I do like the material on this as well. Um, so it's a halter dress like so. And it does have an A-line. It has buttons, which you can perfect is usable buttons so if I just I don't want it all the way up whatever the case may be I can adjust that to my liking and in the back it does have a little stretchy gusset as well um, material is weird it's definitely polyester but it is not shiny so that's also good um, it trying to mimic cotton but it's not cotton at all so yes yeah, so let's see let's let's do a first with halter neck stuff I kind of do a test this should be able to unbutton don't tell me it's not okay so yeah I try to do a test like so it may it may go it may work and it hits like midi length on me so all right let me try this and let's see how this works on me. alrighty guys I am keeping this I like them both and I think I have one more white option as well um i kind of like it to lay down flat like so um but if you like more of your collar coming up a little bit like so you can have that as well it's really up to you um let me show you the rest of the dress um this is what it's looking like i think it looks really really nice <laughs> it does have like a little um nodding detail here um i'm not wearing a bra i took it off mainly because i didn't want to see the bra straps in the back it is a halter so this is what it's looking like i am loving this i don't feel like you get the true picture of what it looks like because i don't know exactly how to angle the camera so you see everything all together um and honestly the camera is kind of at an angle like this so you don't see it head on 
I'm struggling and I'm trying to figure out I'm not a camera guru at all so I'm trying to figure out how to position the camera and if you guys know please let me know but yes it feels very light I feel like I'm gonna double check on this I feel like it may have a bit of cotton in it probably it's like it's a polyester cotton Ella stain mix because it does not feel in comparison to the other white dress um, it doesn't feel as and I don't want to say thick oh because they're both kind of the same um, thickness in terms of material it just doesn't feel as like that one feels like it's less breathable but this one feels like it's more breathable for sure and it's not because I'm having less more or less undergarments because I'm wearing the same um, I do have more buttons I could have buttoned it up here if I wanted to that was just gonna be too much and I could have buttoned it all the way up to here um, obviously I'll put the collar up a bit more instead of laid down I do not like that look whatsoever I think this is a comfortable space it's not showing any cleavage it is perfect I would wear boot tape with this I'm not wearing any I'm not wearing a bra but yes this is this is the thing this is the, <laughs> the, the dress it does also have lining so you are not going to have any issues as well with it being see-through I think I brought I, I bought some really good choices yeah so this is something I honestly I would wear to church um, with a cardigan although my grandma would call it a little bit blasphemous because my back is out I feel like it is you know not showing me up too much it covers the cleavage it covers it goes pretty much almost down to my ankles this is like a midi length on me and I think it looks good <laughs> okay this next is a bit is a bit out of my comfort zone but I wanted to try it. What this is, is a tube dress. It is tiny. <laughs> it is tiny. This is out of my comfort zone for sure. And I wanted to try something different. The material is decent. I didn't see anything about it being see-through. Although I think this may be a little bit. I think the black flowers may help. But oh, this does not have any zippers because this is quite loose so I would need support I do not like tube bras or strapless bras I hate them with a passion I'm a whoop tape girl so that's what I'll be using um, but for the purposes of this video I'm not putting on any boot tape but I know it's going to hit me here it may cover up the bum <laughs> it might not <laughs> we shall see they were not lying about how short it was but a lot of them were saying, but I'm tall. And I'm like, huh, I'm under five feet, so it should be no problem. Um, I'm going to have to wear shorts on this. Like, I and thankfully I have it. Okay? Like, really short shorts so that if anything, I, I can be able to bend down in peace. And they'll just see shorts. Okay? This is the item. I think it looks really cute. It's really fun it's very feminine um there's no lining at all okay that's as much as i'm going to show you to show you that there's no lining i definitely see myself wearing this um just going out at night most likely with my boyfriend <laughs> i don't think i would wear this on a girl's trip at all um and yeah this will be it tell me guys what you think all right next one this one would be nice um i have a dress sort of like this but they it did say that the material was a lot different so that was something that intrigued me um so it's almost like the red one the red jumpsuit however as you can see it's not a jumpsuit it's a dress um it's giving me like bridal vibes because it's like this blush pink I don't know if it's coming off on camera it is like a cream brown if that makes any sense okay I like this a lot um, it's, as I said it's quite similar to the red jumpsuit but it is a dress now I try to cover up my bra as much as possible it hits right above the knee I like this a lot I actually have something like this it's shorter but in a beautiful green that I got from Shein as well different vendor um but i just love this blushness to it it, it just it was, it was giving me bridal vibes um a lot of people that bought this were pregnant so it was to in, 
you know, to kind of camouflage and, and give room to the baby that they're holding. But for me, I don't have that, so it just flows quite nicely. And I think it looks quite nice. I would wear this to church for sure with something underneath. It has to. I, I'm not that scandalous at all to church. It does have something in the back, like it's that low v-neck. So with me wearing a camisole, it'll work, it'll help for both the front and the back for sure. Sorry, you're showing my bra a little bit. But I love the fact that if I'm wearing this regularly, not to to um, church or anything like that. I would wear it like this for sure. I probably would try to pin it because I don't always like to wear camisoles. I'll try to pin it like here with a, a safety pin um, to see if that works. If not, I'll wear like a lacy camisole so that it will still give some skin but it's not showing everything and, and be done with that. So yes, this is, I like this a lot. I really love the bell sleeves it does make me look a lot more top heavy for sure because everything it it um it kind of outlines the breast and then also it gives you more up top so it does um showcase you as like more top heavy but it's okay to be top heavy for a little bit right <laughs> just for a little bit yes i really like this one and the material the material is really good i don't know if i'm if you guys are seeing the material motorcycle my goodness um, I don't know if you guys are seeing the texture of the material on here um, I'm pretty sure this is like a viscose polyester blend because that's what it's giving to me it doesn't it's not giving me full up straight polyester um, I feel like I want to bring out the the green one to show you the difference but you guys will see that in like a styling video when i'm styling all of these as well um but yes this is the look <laughs> let me go to the other one. Ooh, this one i've been waiting for the longest i've had this in my wish list i had this in my cart for the longest they have it in many different styles and i could not pull the trigger on any of them because i was just like is it too loud is it something i'm queer i had no clue um after a while i was just looking at the reviews and i was like deandra try it the worst thing it is is that it doesn't work and you just send it back um so let me show you what this is okay this was giving me farm rio vibes um, if you have not watched um, India's um, video, she's from Bags and Lifestyle. She did it probably last year talking about Farm Rio and about how their quality, I think she bought something from them herself and she realized the quality, even though they cost a lot because they do cost a lot for what it is. And they're pretty much, they advertise themselves to be a vacation brand. Like it's statement pieces, very colorful, things that you would wear to like Mexico, Brazil, just like it's very colorful stuff like this. And um, people were referring to that on Shein that this is a really good, um, not dupe or alternative but it's reminding them a lot of um farm rio which it does for me as well but i've never done anything this colorful in my life not even when i used to do african dancing were my clothes this colorful <laughs> i'm being honest and that was when i was younger um so let me see, what size did I get this in? I think I got this in a size large or extra large. I got it in a size large. Let me show you the back. The back does have a tying part and then it has a bow. Okay, I wasn't sure about this part. I wasn't sure if you can adjust this bow. This is definitely just detail. They stitched it on. Um, I'm trying to see if there is a zipper anywhere on this because this will be very difficult to put on. Oh, okay, so there is a zipper on this side a bit. All right, that will help to some degree. Um, and it just comes up into this corner. It is lined, so it won't be see-through in this pink color. And let me unravel this knot here because I'm going to need all that space to get through. Um, this is like a baby doll dress. It has puff sleeves and everything is very out there and in your face for sure. It has 
pleating it goes out I don't think yeah this was another part that was a bit um, worrisome for me this part does not Oh, I should have I should have gone with the extra large but I thought it would have been too big this part does not expand that is going to be tight um okay I'm gonna have to try this without a bra I'll get back to you guys it's a sad day I really like how this looks on me it looks wonderful on me once you put it on everything just falls into its place <sighs> and this is why i wanted to do it because people who um put up their pictures it was giving everything i'm gonna have to double check to see if they have a size bigger because i want it it does not sit it does not even it it doesn't it doesn't go it doesn't go i want this so badly where's my phone <laughs> i want this so badly i'm gonna check right now because i am putting it into my cart do you understand i need this dress it looks so nice like it is an a-line shape and it has the plus sleeves and all that stuff but the sleeves just look oh my gosh it looks so pretty um i'm look i'm looking i'm looking i'm I'm telling you I'm looking for it. Let me go to my orders because I'm getting this dress in a bigger size. Should I keep it and just try to lose weight? I am losing. Right? That shouldn't be too bad. And there have been clothes that weren't fitting before that are fitting now. Right? Oh, I think I'm going to keep it. I don't do this often. I really don't and this was one of the more expensive ones this was like almost 30 something dollars okay it's not everything on Shein is, is cheap however in comparison to farm real prices <laughs> this is super cheap okay um, I'm going to take a chance on this take a chance on myself that I'm still consistent and that I'm losing and hopefully I don't think it's gonna happen this summer at all because it's literally right here i zipped up probably like an inch okay i'm not getting it's not exactly at your waist but it's right above it i'm not getting to that at all i still have like an inch or so that needs to be gone which i want to be gone anyway okay so it works with me it's not like it's something that i didn't want to do in general so i am going to keep this dress because there is not a bigger size that i can get so um I'm taking a chance uh let me know what you guys think i think this is stinking pretty it's so pretty it's so pretty oh my gosh it just makes everything just pop oh my goodness even the hairstyle just um it, it makes my hairstyle pop but we shall see we shall see i'll keep you guys update the minute it fits i'm hoping by next year okay let's we're making this pack together it is officially july 8th all right monday july 8th next year 2025 july 8th this needs to fit no ands ifs or buts if it doesn't fit there's a problem okay <laughs> and i'm not selling it nor am i giving it away or am i giving it to what i call again donating it it is so pretty I didn't men mention it is double lined with that same um, pink fabric. It is a really stinking beautiful dress. Okay. I just need to get my body right. <laughs> so um, I'll keep you guys updated on that one. Now let's go into the never ending box. What else is in here? I'm trying to not show you the side. What else did I buy that was white? I don't remember what this is. Oh, yeah. So this, I don't think I have the body for this right as of yet, but it may or may not work. I don't even remember if, I think I got this in a size large, 
um, it is a whole strappy back. I saw something remotely close like this on Netta Porter from a designer brand, luxury designer brand in green. And I was just like, oh my gosh, um, if I could stomach paying that much money, I'll get it. And I, I couldn't stomach paying that much money, so I never got it. Um, I don't know how this is going to work. It does have some give. Um, I don't think my body is right and when I say my body is not right I do have back fat so um, and with this completely being a strappy back it's not completely right but as I said I'm trying to you know trying to get back to me so I'm gonna try it on real quick okay so this is not made for someone who has breast at all it was a chore to put on and I don't think I took that into consideration when buying this um, and if memory serves me correct there were no reviews on this item at all no well there was a few not much pictures only one and it said super cute just like the picture and even on her it looks like it needs some help but she's definitely a lot more slender than I am I'll put up a picture on how it looks on the model. Um, it fits, yes. Do I like it? No, I'm gonna have to send this back. I think I got enough, oh, I think I got enough white things that would work. I really wanted it to work, but I just don't have the body type for it. Um, surprisingly my back doesn't look that bad like you can tell it's meaty <laughs> but it doesn't look super super bad um, this part is supposed to be further down it just doesn't go that way on me as I said it's for a more slender figure and I'm just not that um, I think I got this in a size large or extra large let me see um, I got this in a size large and um, they do have an XL, which is a 12, with the bust being 43.3 inches, the waist being 34.6, and the hip being 72.4. The large is, the bust is 40.9, and I'm nowhere near 40 inches in my bust. The waist is 32.3, and that's, I'm a little bit smaller than that, but it's fine. And the hip size is 70, which is fine because it, it flares out as the A-line. So of course you can have 70 inches there. So that's why I got the large because the dimensions seem like it would fit me very well. But the way how it's cut, it is not working with me. It's not covering this up 40 inches. I don't know if I'm just not doing it well. Like, I feel like this needs to come up like so. You see what I'm saying? I don't like this here. I feel like it would have been better here. That's another problem I have with it. Um, but if this was able to stay up like this, and perhaps I'm just not doing it right, as I said, I'm not willing to finagle with this. And you see this part here, it cinches in and then it cuts into my breast. And I feel like if I had just one more this was repositioned to over here that is what I need it's cut wrong for me um, and it will give you the whole beauty of the dress now I could take it to my tailor and have them take it out because there is a seam here and kind of attach it right here instead do I think it's worth that perhaps not I as I said I got some nice white stuff already white dresses um i don't really think i'm trying to remember them all yeah i don't really think i need this the material is wonderful and i actually do like this brand the brand is called myja m-a-i-j-a -A. um i got a few things from them on here um coincidentally i don't think all of them have worked out um but in terms of like the quality and like the attention to detail and designs that they do do um, I do like the brand for it so that's why um, I did buy a few things from them so, so let's go into the others what is this one 
Oh, I think I remembered. All right, this is another maxi dress. This is what it looks like. There's no straps on this one, thank God. Um, I may put this on with or without a bra. I guess I'll just put on with a bra because it can't hurt. Um, the material at the Empire waist part is the same as the top. Um, you do have some ruching. I think this may touch the ground for me, which I'm not too happy about. Um, let's see how it looks on. Okay, guys. Um, this is what it's looking like. I actually do like it. I don't know how I'm going to wear this because this is not me every day. I can wear this to church, however. It does go all the way down to my feet. So if I were to just wear a little heel, um, this would be fine. It would not touch the ground at all. Um, I think I may keep it. It's like a meh type of situation. It's, it is what it is. Um, I... It's, it's a meh it's a meh it's like it it fits it complements my body um it's definitely not the most breathable material but it's fine um you do have to line the seam at least i like to line the seam right here i don't know if you guys just saw me a while ago i was looking at myself in the mirror um me looking at myself here i think i would wear shapewear with this but it's not completely bad on its own. Um, it does kind of nip in the waist here. <laughs> See, this is what I'm talking about. The camera is kind of nipped down, is angled down, but it does kind of nip in the waist here to kind of accentuate your curves a little bit or um, give you a little curve type of situation. Um, I don't know. You guys let me know what you guys think about this. I'm leaning a bit towards no, so I'm gonna pack it up, but it doesn't hurt to have something like this in your closet, you know, just something you could just put on real quick out the house. Um, and it's simple, it's a nice color. Um, you know, it can go with a lot of different things. Um, I feel like it does nothing for me. I'm leaning towards not having it. I'm just gonna send it back. So in total, out of everything, I think I bought like almost 20 items. I'm returning half of it. Nine of them is going back. Um, I think the ones that I got are really nice winners. I'm happy that I was actually able to incorporate or get some white dresses in my closet because I've been needing that for the longest. I do want a more, um, more strappy spaghetti strap type one. Um, and that's why I wanted the Maja one for, but that's just not it. I'm going to look for something else. It may not be from Shein, it may be from someplace else. Um, but yes, this is the Shein haul. Um, I'm going to return those and then I do have some other things in my cart right now that I want. It's about 16 items, but I got to dwindle that down. It can't be that much. Um, and... Um, yeah, this is the ending of the video. I hope you guys are doing well wherever you are and as always have a good one. Bye